Many people will be eligible for up to $1,200, and for every qualifying child 16 or under, you could get up to $500. As of right now, it will be a one-time payment. However, officials say future bills could mean more payments. So Kimberly Washington is joining us live here to answer some of these questions. Let me start off with this question for you, Kimberly. Who yes. can expect this? They call this a stimulus right. check. So who can expect it? Right. So these are for individuals who actually will meet certain income thresholds. And so if you are an individual who have an adjusted gross income under $75,000 for a single individual, or if you're married, file and joint, this will be under $150,000. These individuals can expect to get this stimulus payment. One thing you do want to keep in mind this is based off of your AGI your adjusted gross income so when you look at that tax return it's just not the total income that you receive throughout the year but it's your income minus certain deductions and those individuals can expect to receive this money all right so the government um and also, you want to talk a little bit about like the married couple as well, right? So it's not for, you've got to qualify. There right. are limitations. And then um, it's different for single filers and then married people and yes. also people who have children too, right? Right, also for people who have children. So if you claim children on your tax return, you'll be able to get $500 in addition. But you do have to keep in mind the child has to be under the age of 17 and has to also be claimed on your tax return too as well. So that's some things that you do want to keep in mind. Keep also in mind that it is based off of your 2019 tax return. And if you have not filed your 2019 tax return, also look at your 2018 tax return. That information can be utilized to determine whether or not you'll get the stimulus payment.